If you're anything like me, seeing a custom sled always gets you amped up for riding, but more so it makes you wish that manufacturers would bring to the market custom sleds right out of the box. Skidoo has come close with its XRS models in both flatland and mountain markets. However, there was never an option to spec these sleds to truly set you apart from everyone else who ordered it. While the XRS is still a first-class production, it simply lacks the feeling of customization. The Summit line has traditionally been Skidoo's testing ground for new technology and innovative ideas. And in 2011, the Summit Freeride hammers both those nails directly on the head. The Freeride's base RS chassis is the same chassis used in Skidoo's race sled and in the XRS. It features ultra-wide running boards that taper further to the back of the tunnel. Now because this is a Summit, the tunnel has been stretched out to accommodate a 154-inch snow shovel. Starting to sound like an XRS Summit, right? Wrong. While the Freeride does share the aforementioned highlights with the 2010 XRS Summit, from this point forwards it takes a dramatic turn. The entire tunnel and running boards all the way back to the bumper have been powder coated in a super crisp white paint to match the gas tank cover, white side panels, and white hood. While this looks cool on its own, the ski spindles, riser block, and rails in the skid get gold anodizing, giving the trickest aftermarket look for a production snowmobile that I've ever seen. Oh, and on top of all that, Skidoo is offering a choice of a full sled graphics wrap in six designs and two color choices. But wait, there's more. Realizing that free riders go big, seek out the impossible, and demand more from their snowmobiles, Skidoo's engineering department outfitted the free ride with the hard goods that will really make a difference. Out back is the SC5 MR skid that's been specifically tailored to free riding and features the KYB Pro 40 piggyback race shocks. This skid is designed to take big abuse, and aiding it is a rear swing arm that's mounted 4.5 inches further back to accommodate a longer rear shock that can take the abuse of big landings. Rails are reinforced, and a standard four idler wheel cluster is in the back of the skid that adds additional strength and support. The 800 e -Tech under the hood delivers amazing power with a gentle press of the thumb, and it'll launch you forwards with a vengeance. The 800 e -Tech brings a new level of power and control to the mountain. When you stab the throttle at the bottom of a big chute, the power comes on instantly, stays strong, and continues to adjust to the optimized maps for the altitude you're running at. In mountain scenarios, there's nothing better. Low speed precision seems to be touchier than the PowerTech, but that's my only complaint. It seems almost surreal when you dip your arms down into the powder, feel the snow plow over the nose of the sled, then crack the throttle and feel the track clear any amount of snow, and float the sled up and on top of the snow with ease. Where most sleds will need a moment to clean out and clutch down to pull a big old 2.25 track, the E-Tech leans out and hits the spot like a crispy chicken. From the cockpit, the Freeride stance is right on target. The five inch riser and the tapered bars put the controls right at the perfect spot for free riding. And not to mention when you want to pull a good left or right hook, it's really easy to move back and forth. The combination of the ultra wide running boards and the ergonomically perfect handlebar setup eliminates any reservations about footing. And thanks to the ultra narrow race seat, you're not bow legged and hoping that your boot has enough grip when you jump over to the other running board. After only moments aboard the free ride, you actually stop worrying about where your feet are because there is so much acreage to plant them. While the basics of the free ride aren't something that you can actually spec out, the ability to style your sled and be different is, making this a custom sled and the answer to what the free ride nation has been asking for.